On Monday, April 17th, the City of Boston celebrated Patriots Day with the 121st running of the Boston Marathon. Two Pittsburgh residents took part in the tradition, and Nick Bartelli has the story of one who cracked the top 200. Minnie No Chion is a St. Mary's Colgan coach and teacher who loves routine. Chion encapsulates all routine when he prepares for one of the most taxing physical tasks on the human body. I've been fortunate to participate in a lot of different sporting events, whether it's coaching, playing, but I've never experienced one like the Boston Marathon. Chion shares with his students about his experience, which is above what many get with the race. The Pittsburgh math teacher placed 196th in the entire pack. That is in the top 1% with the nearly 30,000 people that run the Boston Marathon. His official time was 2 hours, 40 minutes, and 33 seconds. Yeah, you know, I can think back to, you know, like the junior high when I couldn't run under six minutes a mile, and now you think, oh my gosh, I'm, I'm running faster per mile for 26 miles. <laughs> Those two hours don't get boring for Chion. As far as the race itself, it's, I, I always feel uh, incompetent to describe it because it's, like I said, there's a million fans out there screaming, you know, literally a million, you know, not, not hyperbole. There's not a section of course from Hopkinton to Boston where there's not somebody cheering for you. I was telling somebody the other day, they cheer for the people who run fast, and I think they cheer even louder for the people who run slow because they have this recognition that those people need it more than the people at the front of the pack. Chion runs for more than just the fans' support. I think just as uplifting is some of the other competitors in the race. I, and I don't know if perhaps you saw there was a Marine who was a single leg amputee, carried the flag the whole way. And you, know, you run by that guy during the race, and it's yeah, you, know, you think, wow, this is hard and difficult. You see what he's doing, and you stop feeling sorry for yourself pretty quickly. He has been fortunate to run the Boston Marathon with little major injury, but not every race goes without a trial. As I was running up that hill, right about the 25 mile marker, started to cramp a little bit, and I, I went from this surge of confidence of I think I can do it to oh no, am I gonna even be able to finish? And make it did he with a high finish and aspirations for more. My best friend, he. He said, how many of these are you going to do? I said, I, a million. You know, I, I, it's such a unique experience and fun experience, rewarding experience that I, I can't imagine ever not doing it. Coach Chion has run in eight Boston marathons and said he plans on lowering his time for next year.